It's time to set sail with robot bartenders. Cruising just got a high-tech upgrade. I'm Bridget Carey here on a cruise ship. That's right, you don't typically think about high tech when you're on the high seas, but Royal Caribbean's changing that with their newest ship, Quantum of the Seas. This is the most high tech ship out there. So I came aboard to check out what makes it so high tech. It all starts before guests even get on the ship. RFID tags are placed on luggage. They can use an app to monitor when the luggage gets to their stateroom. Also, guests wear RFID wristbands. They serve as a room key and you can tap it on sensors to pay for things. Typically on a cruise you unplug from the world because it can be too costly to stay connected. But not here. It's the first ship designed to keep guests connected and the price is reasonable. We've changed the whole business model from charging more than you need to to prevent people from trying to use it because you just don't have enough capacity to we have enough capacity so we'll be offering this at hotel style rates you know 12 to 15 dollars a day and you'll be able to stream this type of connectivity and bandwidth has not been seen on a cruise ship before in fact the ship has an xbox arcade where you can connect to xbox live to play with friends on land as you overlook a bumper car arena Right now we're inside one of the indoor staterooms. And when it comes to cruise ships and indoor staterooms, you don't get a window outside, you don't get a balcony, but on Quantum, you can get a virtual balcony. This is a television that shows you footage of what really is happening outside. There are webcams all around the ship, and it's also relative to where you are on the ship. They're not all the same image. If you're on the back of the ship, you're gonna see what it looks like on the back of the ship. This room we're in right now is called 270. And what makes it unique is that as part of the entertainment on stage, right above, you have six different screens all attached to robotic arms. These 100-inch robo screens are choreographed to music and dance together with live entertainers as images are projected on the back glass wall. But perhaps the best high-tech highlight is over at the Bionic Bar. Robot bartenders mix drinks that you order on tablets. You can pick from the menu or create a custom drink. Now, if you're wondering about security and how they control who orders what, it all comes down to the bracelet you wear. So you, before you order, you have to tap the bracelet to the screen so it knows you're of age. And to pick up your drink, you also need to tap your bracelet so it verifies that it's you who ordered this drink. To learn more about these robot bartenders, be sure to watch CNET's newest show, Tomorrow Daily. For CNET, I'm Bridget Carey.